Are you curious about how to send power and wired data to your Microsoft Surface Go 2 using power over ethernet? Well then stick around to see how it's done. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use our GAT USB-C PD inline adapter. This is a PoE to USB-C adapter designed to provide both power and wired data to your Microsoft Surface Go 2, all using a single USB Type-C connection. Let's check it out. You might remember seeing this in other videos, but this is our BT1 55 volt 60 watt injector. It's a single port gigabit mid-span injector, and this specific model comes with 6 kV surge protection. The first step is to connect your input data to the LAN port on the injector. The first thing you'll see when you open the box for the GAT USB-C PD is a QR code that links you to the online manual. Simply position your camera app on your phone above the code and it will prompt you to open the link. The GAT USB-C PD sits in line and converts 802.3 AT PoE into the power delivery profiles shown on screen. It also provides fast 10-100 megabit per second ethernet over the USB-C connection. There are LED indicators for input power and data on the female RJ45 port. This adapter also includes a bi-directional USB-C to USB-C cable with one right-angled head for a clean tablet installation. Once we connect the patch cable from the injector to the adapter, the LED lights indicate is being powered on and has data available. I want to quickly mention that we have switch configurations available on the technical center if you use this adapter with the Cisco Enterprise switch. This is accessible through the QR code seen earlier and will be linked in the description box below. As soon as I connect the USB-C cable to the Microsoft Surface Go 2, it detects a charge. And in the network status under settings, you'll see it's connected to Ethernet. If you haven't done so already, now would be the perfect time to check out our new website design. Let us know what you think. The Ethernet connection is confirmed once we go to a web page and do a quick search. The web page loads and the connection is steady. With the help of one inline adapter, you're now able to power and provide wired data to your Surface Go 2 all using power over Ethernet. That does it for today everyone, but thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, be sure to let us know by giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel. And make sure to hit that bell icon, that way you can be notified every time we upload. Interested in other types of videos instead? No problem, just leave us a comment down below on what you'd rather see. And don't forget to check out our other channels too. We post to Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, LinkedIn, and Amazon too. See y'all next time.